Wait, does anybody have a friend that they're willing to just give their number to Sue? Uh, oh, like, oh, dude. Yeah, yeah give me yeah, one of your friend's, friend's numbers. On give me one of your friend's numbers and, and like, tell me, like, let me know their name and, like, something about them. And I'm just like, hey, Dave, what you cooking for dinner? My friends are all on the call. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I'll give you a number. Wait, you sure? What's, what's their name? <laughs> his name's Brendan. Oh, I texted him his own number. No, no, no. I messed it up. Wow. You Unfucking believable. Maybe he won't see it. Just send it real quick. Okay, okay. All right, well, here it goes. I'm going to be sexual to your friend Brendan. Is he above 18? I'm yes. assuming. He's okay. older than me. Why would you be friends with like a 16 year old boy? <laughs> Hi, you've reached the voicemail. No! Oh, this is so awkward. <laughs> <laughs> I know. He says, is there a reason you text me my number? Hi, you've reached the voicemail box of Brendan. Okay, fuck Brendan, we're moving on. <laughs> I'm, right. gonna, I'm just going to spam call. <laughs> Hello? Hi, uh, is this Brendan? Yes. Uh, what you doing around 7 o'clock tonight? Who's this? <laughs> This is Dave. <laughs> He's gonna Dave. hang up immediately. <laughs> Dave Matthews. <laughs> this is Brendan, right? The guy with brown hair. Got like a ginger beard thing going on. <laughs> do I do I know you? Yeah, it's, it's Dave. We talked the other day. He, you said you'd invite <laughs> me over for some breadsticks. <laughs> <laughs> Hello? Do not recall this conversation. Uh, <laughs> no, you said Wednesday come over. We can have him bread dick. Tell him, tell him you want to come over for a Chinese Monday. Or a, maybe it was Chinese Monday. You said something about. Hello, Brandon. I think you got the wrong person. No, you eat Chinese food every Monday, right? I was wondering if I could come over and have a bite. <laughs> Bro, he's gonna report you for stalking. <laughs> this man is gonna report you for stalking. Ran around the house, locked every door, loaded up the shotgun. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, you've reached the voice. Just, uh, just tell him you're there. Just be like, I'm here. <laughs> I'm, fi I'm five minutes away from your address. You got dinner ready? Hi, you've reached the voice mail box. <laughs> one more time, one more time. <laughs> He's got to answer again, bro, please. <laughs> He's got to be so confused that you know he eats Chinese food every Monday. <laughs> yeah, that's, I was just like, wait, what? Should I text him? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to text him and say, uh, call me when you can. <laughs> <laughs> now just be like, so that's a no on the breadsticks. <laughs> I feel like he blocked my number, like, immediately. <laughs> So just that's some redneck note. calling you asking about dinner. <laughs> I've never even tell him about this. Just let him wonder yeah. the rest of his life what happened that day. No, if he ever asked me, I'm gonna be like, "What happened? What do you mean? I don't know what you're talking about." <laughs> so Dave. my name was Dave Matthews. Dave Matthews. <laughs> <laughs> I'd say, okay. All right, one more try. Come on, Brendan, please answer. Hi, you He definitely oh, declined that. He declined it. <laughs> Text him and said, "Answer, please." Come on, Brendan. Me hungry. <laughs> he's just reading that fucking text. He's probably like, who is this crackhead? <laughs> is the game over with? No, no. it's two to one. That's it. I'm making a call. Who are you calling this time? Domino's. Aloha, and thank you for calling Domino's. What? Please stay on the line to hear a couple of our best specials. We are now hiring happy people over the age of 16. Happy people? <laughs> <laughs> so I can't yeah, work there for something depressed? <laughs> they mean gay? Your order. <laughs> <laughs> now hiring gay. I'm going to submit my application right now. We're now hiring the gays at Domino's. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> hey, um... Can you uh, tell me some of the specials y'all got going on with like boneless chicken? Okay, are you guys gonna be picking up or for delivery? I'll be picking it up. Uh, one moment, please. All right. I hope he came on the line right as you said we're hiring the gays. <laughs> you just hang up on you. How many specials know. they got on chicken? <laughs> He goes and gets like a scroll, has to unroll it. <laughs> Let me consult Guys, the please archives. Stop. Please. Let stop. me consult the archives please for stop. that one. I'll be right with you to take your order. Whoa. <laughs> what the <laughs> fuck? Yeah, yeah, sorry about this. So we do have a large three topping, eleven ninety nine for carryout. 
Is, does that come with the chicken? <laughs> um, so you can do a medium two topping pizza with eight piece chicken wings for seventeen ninety nine. <laughs> hmm. What about what if uh, you said that was eighteen ninety nine? Uh, seventeen ninety nine. Medium two topping eight piece wings. What if I wanted to add in a really long breadstick? <laughs> breadstick? Yeah, a long one. Uh, we only have one size breadstick. Y'all don't have the extra large and long breadstick. <laughs> oh, this is so painful to listen to. <laughs> that shit was so painful to listen to, man. Oh my god. <laughs> Yo, I, got I was cringing so hard. <laughs> uh, I have a friend you can call if you want to try it again. Alright. What, what's some stuff about him that I should know? You can probably say, hey, are you still dating that teacher? Um, He's probably like... Damn, you about to expose him? What the fuck? <laughs> oh, dude, I could do something like, uh, hey man, I think I hooked up with your girl last night. Uh, <laughs> just wanted to let you know. <laughs> just want to let you know. She said she was a teacher or something. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> just like, oh no, that, that's, that's causing yeah, relation. No, yeah, oh, fuck, dude, I should fucked. do that and literally be like, yeah, I just wanted to call and let you know that I actually have an STD now. <laughs> Like, no, don't fucking cause relationship problems. <laughs> Should I do that, McNasty? No. What's your friend's name, McNasty? Uh, Ryan. Does Ryan? Does he drink? Yeah, he does a lot. Maybe I should like convince him that we had gay sex or something. <laughs> one do you know like a bar name that he goes to, or where he would have went, or something? Um, bar name? Probably shenanigans. Shenanigans, okay. So you're gonna call his friend and pretend that y'all got drunk and hooked up one night. I, I yeah, and I'm gonna sex, tell him that so. I, I got an STD and then he needs to go get checked out. Oh, this is epic. <laughs> I'm fully prepared for this. I have been on a phone call like this before. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> oh. Hey. Hi, this is Ryan. Yeah, uh, I was calling to give you some bad news, actually. I don't, I know we haven't spoken in a while, but. I, you know, I actually had to go to the doctor the other day, and I just figured I'd call you and tell you before anything bad happens, so. How have you been, Ryan? Uh, to be honest with you, I'm not sure who this is. May I ask who this is? Oh, this is Dave. You don't remember? <laughs> we, uh, I thought you might have had my number saved, but we, uh, <clears throat> we had met at Shenanigans, uh, you know, a few months back. You don't remember? You don't remember meeting at Shenanigans like a few months ago? I was kind of worried you wouldn't remember, which is why I'd, you know I figured I'd call you. No, I have no idea. Well, I haven't been to that place in like well over a year. Are you sure it was a few months ago? Well, yeah, it could have been a year ago. I mean, you know, time's getting away from me in the quarantine and all. But uh, <laughs> you were you were talking about like you were uh, dating this teacher at the time or something. But I just want to let you know that. You know, that night after shenanigans when you were drinking all your craft beer stuff or whatever, and we hooked up, you know, I went to the doctor and I actually tested positive for an STD, so. <laughs> okay, who the fuck is this? <laughs> this, is, this is Dave. We met at shenanigans. Bar. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I didn't He's understand. I really mean, well. You, you kept talking about. This girl you were dating was a teacher or something, but you were fucking me like a man. <laughs> you know. I just want. I just want to too, let you know shit, that man. Uh, you should probably go to the doctor and get checked because no, it. I can hear it in your voice, motherfucker. What? <laughs> Josh. Josh, this is Dave. We met at Shenanigans. We, we literally had gay sex. Did he have gay sex with Josh? <laughs> Okay, this is coming up. This is a bit ridiculous. I'm at work, bro. Well, <laughs> oh, fuck. I, mean, I don't. 
I fucking laughed. I laughed. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> this whole time he actually had gay sex with somebody named Josh. <laughs> Josh? <laughs> Josh? Like, Man, I, did, I did it twice. <laughs> <laughs> so I need to stop going to shenanigans. <laughs> Any more friends on the list? I love how there's two different types of white people. <laughs> they call the police white people and they'll laugh it off. Yeah. Like, I'm still like, 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 as you're doing this bit, I'm still like trying to get my friend to not call the cops on you. <laughs> <laughs> Please don't get the fucking cops on me. Could you he's, imagine? He's threatening to dox my, my face to people now because he's mad. <laughs>